Hey, I'm Chris, and I'm going to show you how to build a custom user interface using LabVIEW for your data acquisition applications. So LabVIEW makes it very easy to build custom user interfaces by simply dragging and dropping controls and indicators on your front panel. So if we switch over to LabVIEW, you'll see I've already dropped my DAC Assistant where I'll be acquiring my data. And to display that data, I can right-click my front panel and select a graph indicator to display the data. And you'll notice that when I place that control on my front panel, a corresponding terminal will be displayed on the block diagram. And so I can wire the output of my DAC assistant to that control, and you'll see when I run the application, the data is displayed on the front panel. So in addition to waveform graphs, we can also drag and drop other controls like basic numeric controls or a basic numeric indicator. Or we can even add fancier control, numeric controls like a pointer or a knob or fancier numeric indicators like a gauge or even a thermometer. In addition, we can add Boolean controls such as buttons and toggle switches and Boolean indicators, such as a square or round LED. And again, for each of these controls, you'll see it's created a corresponding terminal on the block diagram. So if I wire each control to its corresponding indicator, and then I run the VI, you can see that when I change the control, the values on the indicators are changed as well. In addition, we can also organize our controls and indicators using containers. So if I right click my block diagram, I can go to the containers palette and I'll use a tab control to organize all my controls and indicators. So I'm going to put the waveform graph on the first tab and then I can select the remainder of my controls and place them in the second tab. So now when I run the VI, you can see I have my waveform graph in the first tab and I can sw switch over and the remainder of the controls are in the second tab. LabVIEW also allows you to customize each individual control. So we can use the Tools palette and we can change the color of certain controls. Or we can even make parts of controls transparent so that it better flows with the rest of our design. And that's how you build custom user interfaces using LabVIEW for your data acquisition applications.